Good morning, superstars. I hope you've had a wonderful weekend. Today, I wanna to talk about something that we started to learn at the very beginning of the year, the alphabet. It's something that you are going to use for the rest of your life. I use it every day and so do you. Our friend and favorite author, Mo Willems, has written a story using the alphabet. There is a word on here for every single letter of the alphabet and we're gonna read through it. All right, I hope you enjoy A Busy Creature's Day Eating an alphabetical smorgasbord by Mo Willems. A busy creature's day eating. A busy creature's day eating. Do you see that? A, B, C, D, E. Each of those words starts with one of the letters in the alphabet in order. Oh my gosh. Apples. Berries. Cereal. A, B, C. Donuts. Eggs. Hmm? Oh my goodness. Not only are we having all of our letters here, we've got D and E for donuts and eggs. But look at that. What is that? A question mark and an exclamation mark. Furniture. Guys, what's he eating now? The furniture? Like the tables and the chairs? I think I was okay with everything he was eating before, but not the furniture. What else is he gonna eat? Something that starts with a G, you're right. Gravy, huge hot sauce halibut hoagie, a big sandwich. Ice cream, G H I. Jacket. Kilt. That is a type of clothing. It kind of looks like a skirt. Lunchbox? Can we eat those things? No, this creature is very silly and he must be very hungry to be eating all of this stuff. Mayonnaise? Napkin? Oh. M N O. M and N, he's still eating, but is he eating O? No. It, he's feeling it with his tummy. How does his tummy feel? His face shows me his tummy feels sick. Probably because you shouldn't be eating furniture and jackets, huh? Potty! There's letter P. He's running to the potty. Queasy? Ooh. Queasy means when you're feeling like you want to throw up. Rice. Saltines. R and S are some things his dad is saying to help him feel better. Eat those things to feel better. T, is he still feeling good? No, he feels sick. Ugh. You, he did not like the taste of the tea. And V is for vomit. Uh-oh. That's really sad. That doesn't feel good, huh? Water, his dad is asking him if he wants water for W. He's crying a little bit. X is XO, XO, XO. And XO means hugs and kisses. Aw, I need a lot of love when I throw up too. That does not feel good. Y is for yawn. <sighs> Looks like he's sleeping now. And what's our last letter? Z. Z is for zonked for sleepy. Z end. There he is. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. And they all have a bite out of them because that busy creature ate so much. Boys and girls, I love this story because Mo Willems had to get creative. He had to think of one word for every letter of the alphabet that still told a story. He told a story using only words that started with the letters of the alphabet, like A, B, C, D, and E, in order. Boys and girls, I really hope you enjoy this story. And if you feel like it, maybe take the challenge. See if you can write a story that uses all the letters of the alphabet in order just like that. Boys and girls, I hope you loved that story and I hope you have a wonderful day. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.